this cop right here, he's patrolling the community. It's a good thing. It's a good thing. All cops. If you like being away from the office, if you don't like working in the office and you like being out and about patrolling your community, good on you. Don't listen to your boss who always, you might have a boss that wants you to stay in the office all the time. This cop is a hero. He becomes a hero this day. Pay attention to the school bus on the left-hand side. Pay attention to the school bus. Somebody tries to ram it. Watch us. No volume. Volume will come on. Driver gets out. Start shooting at the school bus. <laughs> now, I don't know what my title is, but maybe the title gave it away, but... You know who the driver is shooting at? The driver of the school bus? His wife. That's the husband. He's mad at the wife. They're not getting along today. He starts shooting, and she has the sense to reverse this bus. This would have been the perfect time, there he is, to run him over. So the cop's going to do a U-turn right here. He's going to follow the vehicle. He's going to follow the bad guy. There he is, right? Bad guy's going to take off, right? Bad guy does a U-turn. He's going. He's not done with the bus driver. He's not done with his wife. I don't know what he's mad. He's. She probably took the phone cord to work. You know what I'm saying? That pissed me off. So they're fighting over a phone cord, I think. I love how she drives. She's a good woman driver. So you think that'd be the end of it, right? <clears throat> this guy is motivated. <laughs> He's really mad at her. I, I, lunatics. This pursuit goes on for nine minutes. Guess where he's going? He's going to the school district. Because his wife works there. Could you imagine being that angry at your wife? And uh, westbound on uh, Orange Slope. So we have wrong way and then westbound on Orange Slope. Wrong way, westbound Orange Slope. Thirty-two heavy. Here we go. Into the parking lot of the school, guys. We got people back here in the school. You guys gotta jam him up. This, this, we gotta stop this. We got citizens back here. I don't know. He's trying to kill his ex-wife. I have her at school. That's a hard copy. Bye bye. Body cam. Into the parking lot of the school, guys. We got people back here in the school. You guys got He's got his gun out. I don't know. Bad guy's got a gun. I think I want my gun ready. I've been watching a couple of these videos lately, and I'm like, where's your carbine? Where's your machine gun? Watch what happens to this cop's firearm. Can't get the magazine out. Stand by. by. There's a gun. Oh, Drop the gun. Stand by. Stand by. Okay. There's a gun in his hand. There's a gun in his hand. Stand by. Drop the gun. Stand by. <coughs> There's a gun in his hand. Gun in his left hand. He has a gun. Drop the gun. Drop the gun. Drop the gun. Drop the gun. 601. Stand by. Stand by. Stand by. Anyways, bad guy goes bye bye. He's dead. And, uh, 
I'm not going to criticize anybody. But come on. Nobody's talking about this. Nobody's talking about this. Why is nobody talking about this? If you think about it, this is amazing. Nobody's talking about this. Have you heard about it? Not really. No one's talking about it. This guy tried to murder his wife. Guess who else was in the bus during the pursuit? A six-year-old student. Six years old. Learning a lot. Learning about life. Why aren't we focused on this guy instead of Kyle Rittenhouse? Why aren't we upset with the courts that allowed him to be out and about instead of in prison? Summary of his charges. Rape. On no contact conditions with his wife. Arm robbery. Oh, manslaughter. Hmm. Drugs. Domestic violence. His parole was revoked. Had a warrant for breach of conditions. He cut off his electronic monitor bracelet. Cut it off. But no, we care about Kyle Rittenhouse crossing state lines. (laughs) That's our world right now. We talk about people who aren't criminals. That's who we focus on. Like, why isn't this... A mass, a huge story. Tries to kill a lady and a kid inside a school bus. Anyway, whoever that police officer is, good job, man. You saved the day. You saved a life. Possibly two lives. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Subscribe. Not my best stuff, but... I thought you'd like it. I loved it. Have a good day. Bye-bye. What's that?